Right then, we're going to talk a little bit more about security. Now, we've all got a room within a room. So uh, if you've got one room going to another for security reasons, and also you put a big door on there, it's a nuisance in the way. Well, what I do is I have two little doors, two little homemade doors as usual. And um, all I do is I put a and a lock on it. So I don't put a padlock or anything like that. All I use is a simple clip like this, because if they're this side of the door, you are screwed, they are in. But if they're that side of the door, you're not fitting in here, you're not having to carry keys or any aggro with you, because all you do is when you get through, you do that. By the way, you've still got stuff. You can hang stuff on your doors that you make. Make two little half doors. So they're the other side, you're this side. Um, and it's simple. It's time to lock up and go home, and lock up and go in the house. And all you do is that. And there we are, right. Now, I'm also going to give you a little security. What I, my very first security system that I fitted. Obviously, you've got your standard lock and your standard padlock. But also, you can have a little secret bolt, a little secret switch. Just make a hole in the wall, put a copper pipe in it, stick your bolt in. You see how that twists left and right, left and right? And all you have to do is come the other side of the wall and fit yourself or get yourself a switch, a switch that twists, that basically turns it on and off the other side. That's all you have to do. So you can turn that on and off and then all you have to do then is get a bolt and at the end of the bolt put a nail. Oh, can you see that? Put a nail at the end of the bolt. So when that door opens, it goes through a hole in the frame of the door, a uh, hole at the frame of the door, which is there. And inside there is a little micro switch. So there we are, look. So now they've opened the door, and now the little micro switch is screaming its head off. You've got some sort of an alarm, an air horn system. We've all got bits and pieces out of the car that we can just switch on. Um, but the problem they've got in this one is they've also got a baddie door behind it. So they've not only got to get past that when I had that one, that was my first system. They've also got to get past this. So, um, yeah, you can always make your place secure. Oh, you can always make your safe, make your safe secure and make the internal door as noisy as possible so that they make a noise coming through. And meanwhile, the alarm will be screaming its head off. Right, that's my uh, second tutorial on security, homemade cheap security.